Hello everyone and welcome back to the 100 baby challenge where um what are you doing Bob? You're just cleaning the house. How lovely. That's that's very nice of you and you're just kind of hanging out over here Wilbert. Cool. Um it's been a while since I've recorded anything so um <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Um in the last episode we moved out whatever their names are. Uh Beatrice and Andy. I remembered. I know what I'm doing. Um, we moved up Beatrice and Andre, so Bridget needs to get pregnant once again because that is why we're here and what we're doing. Someone went downstairs. Oh, Bridget. Hello, are you just playing cards on your own? Cute. A little bit sad as well. You're just grabbing cake. Okay. Um, oh, it's so nice to be in this massive house. I feel like, um, yeah, we we just have so much space and it's lovely. And we also have so many things for toddlers to play with and we have no toddlers. So we should probably... Um, yeah, start working on that first of all. Uh, and then once we have gotten Bridget pregnant, I thought it might be nice to go and have a look at Hazel's kids and George's kids because we haven't visited them in a while. So maybe we'll do that today. That would be nice. Okay, Bridget, that means we need to start by traveling somewhere. Do you know anyone here that we can have a baby with? I feel like you only know other baby daddies already. So let's travel with you and then... How do I do that again? Travel. Um, just Bridget, please, and then we'll see who we can get pregnant with. Oh, hello everyone. You guys are just doing stuff here. Okay, let's uh, make our choice. Who do we want to go for? Well, these guys seem busy, so let's go for you. Funny introduction. Why not? Who are you? Tyler. Nice to meet you, Tyler. How you doing? Do you want to have our baby? Okay, let's... Uh, oh, we can kiss his hand immediately? Wow, Bridget. Okay. Let's ask him if he's single first, maybe. Uh -huh. And then we can... Um, I don't know. Compliment his appearance. He is single. How lovely. He did like that. Uh, see if he likes a little flirt. There are bees flying about. Lovely. Ooh. Okay, he is very much into us right now. Good. Um, let's exchange numbers, maybe. And then... I don't know. Do a pickup line. He's a little bit sleepy, which is not great. Oh, no, he's... he's Nope, no, no. Okay, something is not going wrong. Let's... Or something is going wrong, rather. Let's see. Um, ask the cloud guys. Let's do that. You guys have fun. Also, we can't go in your house yet because we haven't asked to go in your house, which is a little bit annoying. Well, it is a nice looking house. Marie can now discuss color theory. Good for her. Um, oh, there is a person. Hello. What's your name? Jagger. Nice to meet you, Jagger. How are we doing over here, guys? Pretty good. Um, can we knock on the door, Bridget, so that I can go inside? And then you guys can just cloud gaze more. Knock on the door. Lovely. Come on in. Thank you, guys. There are a lot of guys in this house. I think they're just guys in this household, which is why I downloaded it. So um, these guys are probably future baby daddies. All of them. Um, this is the next household we shall tackle. Are you guys arguing? Oh, no, you seem to be doing... Ah, you're bros, probably. I don't know. I don't know how bros work. Um, you don't seem to have a single double bed in this room or this house though, which is not great for us. Um, can we do some more flirting now? Let's do share insecurities and do a self-deprecating joke. The romance festival is in town. That is perfect. Let's um, see if we can travel with him. And here we go. Romance festival it is. Uh, let's uh, pause the game and then see. There's somewhere we should be able to drink stuff to make ourselves, yeah. Drink that together and we should get all flirty. And that should make this pretty easy for us. Hello, you guys look very similar. You are Michael and Casey. Nice to meet you guys. Okay, we're feeling flirty. Cool, let's joke about getting together. Gossip about these guys, the tea effects. Throw some petals. Just do all of the stuff that we can do here. Just kiss his hand. And oh, do a flirt, sexy pose, offer him rose. Just do all of the things, Bridget. Express admiration. Admiration is probably what is said. He is enjoying it, which is good. 
Oh, we leveled up in our charisma skill apparently. Good. Can we um do first kiss yet? No. Let's confess our attraction. Everyone is babbling. Christ. Um, ask a risque question. He's gonna go buy food. Yeah, I don't care. Throw petals. Mention flirty festival vibe. Come on, dude. Just let us. There we go. First kiss. Okay, cool. Let's do that. First kiss? No, he's leaving. Why? No, don't sit down. Go away, Rose. Okay, I think they're about to have their first kiss. Do it. Oh, there it was. Slightly delayed, but that's fine. Lovely. Um, let's travel with him again. Uh, let's just find him here. You. Let's travel with you. Go back home. And have a baby. Okay, we're home. We're still glowing from the festival. Let us try for a baby in the closet. Sure. Don't know which closet you're gonna try for a baby in. Hopefully an appropriate one. Let's see. Are you gonna go try for a baby? Yeah, you are. Okay, you're gonna... Okay, we're gonna go downstairs. That's a little bit awkward. Are you going in here? Oh, looks like it. Oh, he, she disappeared. That's weird. That is really weird. Okay. You have fun in there on your own, mate. You have fun. Um, what are you guys up to? You are cleaning up. Lovely. Everyone's doing pretty good. How are we doing homework-wise? You can do your homework. Uh, how about you? You can do your homework. Uh, Wilbert. No, that's Bob. Bob can do his homework. And Marie can do her homework. How are you doing, Beth? Do your homework as well? Sure. Let's have a little homework session going on. Mm. Kind of curious where people are going to end up sitting down to do their homework outside. Looks like people are going to sit outside. Lovely. I'm going to um, clean that up for you. Maybe? Can I clean that up? No. I can only press it. Okay. Slightly depressing that you decided to do your homework here. Oops. Especially considering you can just look out like that. That, that's kind of depressing. It's it's fine. Oops, I'm, I'm just doing all sorts of things with the controls right now. So everyone else is sat outside. Um, almost? Where Where is Bob? Oh, Bob is sitting up here. Okay, so he's not the only one. That's fine. Uh, Bridget, are you pregnant? That I really would like to know. Where's the toilet? There's the toilet. No, don't use the toilet. I need you to take a pregnancy test. Don't use the toilet. Oh, she used the toilet anyway. Oh no, she took a pregnancy test. Okay, good. Yay, she's expecting... Cool, awesome, lovely. Let's ask Tyler to leave. Um, ask to leave, please. And then you can keep working on whatever it was you were making. Hamburger cake, no. That's a terrible thing to make. Clean that up and then we'll make something that's actually like, you know, tasty. Uh, let's make whatever that is. Where are you going, Bridget? Oh, you're cleaning up more stuff, that's fun. Uh, how are we doing over here? Pretty good. We should plant the rest of these um, so that we have that sorted. Beth has finished her homework. Cool. Can you do extra credit? I'm assuming you can't since I feel like we just aged you up. Yeah, we just aged you up. Can you harvest these things? No, you can't do anything. Um, how about you do something fun in here then? Can you play on this? You can. Play dolls. I didn't know that was a doll thing, but play dolls, I guess. Go for it. Everyone starts to complete their homework. Can you guys do extra credit? You can. Uh, and you can as well. How about Bob and Marie? Oh. Uh, yep, yeah, Bob can. And Marie is still doing her homework, so that's fair. Oh, is she playing with different types of do dolls in this dollhouse? I feel like she is. That's kind of cool. I like that. Um, Bridget, are you cooking for everyone? No, you just decided not to do that. Okay, let's not take uh, a quick meal. Let's instead do not a fruit salad. Just yeah, whatever. Tuna casserole. That's fine. Okay, you decided to take that out anyway, even though I told you not to. Lovely. Um, Maria's finished her homework. Cool. Can you put it back in your inventory? Thank you. And then you can do extra credit. I know everyone's hungry, but just do your homework, and Bridget will sort out the food. Where are you going now, Beth? You're gonna take a shower. Yep, that's fair. You do that. This house is so big, I like lose everyone. How are we doing with the homework? Oh, Bob is down here now as well. Lovely, everyone's doing their homework outside. Except for Beth, who couldn't do extra credit yet. But that's, that's fine. She has just aged up after all. Can you play on this? 
Yes, practice darts, please. I know you're, you wanted to go to bed, but you know what? We're waiting for food to be made, so. Have you actually finished food? You have. Okay, let's have you. Um, cold meal, please. Uh -huh. And then eat a little bit yourself. You can stop doing that and come to the meal instead. Everyone should come and eat. Yeah, once they've finished with their homework. Lovely. She really needs to pee, but that's fine. Are you going to take a serving? Are you just going to stand there? Oh, you took a serving. Cool. Good job. And now sit down, preferably on one of these chairs. Yes, good job. Okay. You really need to pee, my friend. It's okay, Wilbert. You can pee after you've eaten. Marie has completed her extra credit. You sat down there. Will everyone actually sit down at this table this time? That would be amazing. You're sitting down at the table. I swear if you don't sit down at the table now. Are you going to sit in one of these chairs? Oh, I hate you. I fucking hate you. I know you need to pee. Just eat. Um, okay, well, Bridget's done. What do you need to do now, Bridget? Not much, to be honest. Um, I guess you can go downstairs and work on um, your bodybuilder aspiration. That's fair enough. What are you wearing? Did we not give you guys... Um, makeovers. Maybe we didn't. What is Rory wearing? Hmm. Bob. Christ, I always call him Rory. That's Rory, right? Yes, that's Rory. That's Bob. Um, yeah, I feel like these guys need makeovers, maybe. Do they? I can't remember. I am gonna have to go check that. Also, Bob, why are you standing in the middle of the fucking table, you weirdo? Okay, so I decided to give these guys a makeover since they clearly hadn't had one already. This is Marie. She, um, I don't know. I kind of went for something pretty simple on all of them. So this is her everyday outfit. Um, as always, formal, I haven't really changed. Same with athletic, I haven't really changed. Sleepwear, I thought that looked good on her, so I put her in that. Um, and then party-wise, I actually really, really like this piece, but I keep forgetting that it exists, and so I don't use it. And I found it again, and I was like, that actually looks good on you, Marie, so I'm gonna put it on you. Um, and then, okay, hot weather and cold weather I haven't changed, but then this is her swimwear. Now, Bob is um, a bit of a simple guy, I feel, so this is his everyday wear. Formal, I haven't changed at all. Athletic, I haven't changed at all. Uh, sleepwear, I just put him in a t-shirt. And then for party wear, like, you know, he puts on a nice shirt and some skinny jeans and a nice pair of shoes, but there's nothing spectacular about his look here. Um, and then he just has swimwear for swimwear, really. Okay, um, Beth, if you need to pee so bad, then, you know, maybe you should go use the toilet. That is usually pretty helpful. Uh, you need to sleep so you can go to bed. That is fair. Um, you can pee and go to bed. You can pee and go to bed. You can also pee and go to bed. And you, Beth, can I click on you? There you go. Uh, no, that's Bridget. Beth, you are peeing and then you can go to bed as well. And then Bridget, um, you should probably take a shower. Where are you going, Marie? Oh, you're going to pee there. Okay, that's fair. Um, yeah, Bridget should uh, take a shower after Marie is finished peeing, and then uh, we can go visit the babies. That'll be fun. Finish peeing, Marie. Come on. I want to put Bridget in the shower. Um, Bridget has spent 10 total hours of exercise, which um, is great because that was a part of our aspiration. Um, dude, I definitely told you to go to bed, so please do do that. How's everyone doing in their bedrooms? Are everyone everyone in bed you're just taking a nap i'd rather you actually slept um everyone's just taking a nap okay i mean i get it it is 5 p.m but just go properly to bed are you gonna take a nap as well yeah okay go properly to sleep please and same with you marie go properly to sleep and then bridget has just finished taking a shower awesome let's travel alone then bridget and visit your children let's start with hazel shall we oh wow okay hazel's kids have started growing up that's really cool christopher is even a teenager okay and they still have toddler bedrooms so i should probably fix that at some point <laughs> okay bridget time to knock on the door and see if anyone's home they are hello everybody how are we doing let me pause the game and have a look around so this is what's your name again brienne 
Hello, Brienne. And then we have Christopher over here, I assume. You're just standing a little bit in the way there, Malcolm. But yeah, that's Christopher. Lovely to see you again. And then this is Clarissa. Nice. Love that. How is um Christopher... Who was born when? Because didn't Hazel have twins first? Aren't these... Clarissa and Brienne, aren't they the twins that she had first and then she had Christopher? I have no idea, I can't remember, but either way, Christopher's a teenager and the others aren't, for some reason. Who knows why? Um, but yeah, they do still have toddler beds, so I should probably sort that out at some point. And they also have like toddler toys lying around. Um, okay, I'm gonna go into um, Manage Worlds and sort their apartment out because this is a little bit ridiculous. And we are back in. So um, these are the bedrooms. Whoever ends up sleeping in this bedroom kind of drew the short straw here. I do apologize. Um, I just kind of took this from the game catalog really and just kind of plonked it in. It's not that important. I decided not to move anything else because, I don't know, kind of cute that they have some toys standing around, I think. Um, but yeah, let's um, meet everyone. Let's do a cheerful introduction and a cheerful. Bridget is straight onto the treadmill, of course. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, you're ill as well. And also an adult now, which is nice. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to sort you out. Sorry. You guys are just going to sit there and chat a little bit. Can we say hello to Clarissa as well? That would be lovely. How are you guys doing? Are you adults yet? You're an adult, you're an adult, and you're an adult. Cool. You're probably going to be older than Bridget in not too long. Maybe you guys will be uh, elders before Bridget is. Because Bridget has 10 days. Um, yeah, 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 I know that they can't age. Um, she has 10 days until she's an elder. Um, and we need to get so many babies out. Um, so we need to make sure that Bridget is just like constantly pregnant for a little while so that we make sure we have those days. And someone started a painting over here but didn't finish it. Who was that? Um, made by someone who's not even in this household. Okay, good. Also, I just realized something. Where the hell is Rainbow? Did she die? Oh no! I think Rainbow's dead! Oh you guys! Rainbow died and we didn't... I didn't... I wanted to s make sure she was alive for as long as possible and now she's dead and I can't do that and... Oh Hazel and Jane I'm so sorry! I meant to... I meant to come back and, and age her back down! Oh no! Oh now I'm really sad! Oh no. Well, I guess on that note, we'll go and check on, on George, um, Bridget. Let, let's go and, and check on George, shall we? Oh, hello guys. How are you doing? That's Jackson and Jermaine? I'm not quite sure how to pronounce that, but let's knock on the door. Um, that's not their door. That's not their door. Where's their door? Is this their door? Yeah, knock on the door. Oh, hello! Hello, Victoria. Nice to see you. Let's go inside. Um, oh, Christ, there's another baby. How do we even pronounce that? Reen? Renee? <laughs> I don't know. That's his name anyway, or her name. I'm not quite sure. So they had triplets? What is wrong with this family? Everyone is so fertile. I'm so sorry that I, I made this your life. So sorry. Also, we should probably sort out this apartment a little bit so that they actually have like room for fucking three toddlers, man. Holy shit. I was not expecting that when I came here today. Um, okay, well, I'm just gonna sort out your apartment a little bit so that you have a space for these guys. Hang on. Okay, we are back in and I just saw that I misplaced this thing completely so it's slightly outside the wall but we're gonna ignore it for now. Um, this is what I ended up doing. I cut their bedroom in half and I feel slightly bad for Victoria who now has a much smaller bedroom um, but I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure she doesn't mind. Um, this is now the toddler bedroom and we'll make that into a normal bedroom when the toddlers grow up but um yeah let's let's say hello to them shall we let's do a friendly introduction to you go on bridget say hello hello kid how are you doing there are so many of them 
Let's say hello to you. And you're immediately playing with the toys, I can see why. Let's have Bridget join playing with tools, toys, um, and I also added a couple more toys here as well so that they have some stuff to play with. In the living room, how are we doing Bridget? Gonna play a little bit with those toys. Okay, very good, we've said hello to everyone. Let's uh, make sure we, you know, give everyone a hug. Ask to move in, yeah, no. Um, Let's give you a hug, my friend, and give George a hug. Oh yeah, let's share the big news with everyone. Guess what? We're pregnant again. George is a part of this conversation now, and we will be sharing our big news, I think. Are you gonna share your big news, Bridget? Or are you just talking? Become best friends. Aw, oh, cute. Um, can I share big news, or have you already done it? I feel like you've already done it. Aw, oh, you guys are taking a photo together. How adorable. Well, let's give George a hug as well, so that he can feel the love a little bit. Why are you being flirty, Bridget? You're here with your kids and grandkids, which apparently you have six of now. Which uh, I wasn't quite prepared of, but there we are. You have six grandkids. Do you know her? No, okay, let's do a cheerful introduction, since she is your family now as well. Oh, you guys are gonna sit on either bed. That's kind of cute. Let's share our big news as well. Okay, I think we've shared our big news. I'm not quite sure because these animations are slightly odd. I'm not sure they, they particularly like each other. Oh, that's that's really not very nice. Um, okay, well, good. We've now said hello to everyone, sorted out their bedrooms and stuff. Shall we head back, Bridget? Take care of the actual kids that we live with right now? I think that'd be a good idea. Alrighty, back home we are. Um... What do you want to do, Bridget? You want to go sleep. Yeah, that's fair. Go do that. You will have toddlers to take care of any second. Well, not any second. You're probably still in your first trimester. Oh, no. Yeah, you're okay. Yeah, you are still first trimester, second in 13 hours. That is fair. Um, It's Sunday, 11 a.m. Shall we have a pool party? That might be fun. Wilbert, let's see. No, actually, let's make uh, Bridget do this first. Plan a social event, please. Okay, so there is no event that's called like just a pool party, which is slightly sad. Toddler play date might be cool to do, but not while, well, you know, we don't have toddlers right now. So let's just do a normal house party. Host can be Bridget, even though she will be heading to bed. And then I'd like to just like invite everyone really. Andy and Clarissa and Victoria and not those guys, but invite all the toddlers as well. They can all come and uh, not the baby daddies. You guys will already be here. Is that everyone? Um, yeah, I think that's everyone. Okay, cool. Let's invite all you guys. You can have an entertainer. Sure, let's hire an entertainer. Let's uh, hire a mixologist and let's hire a caterer because we can. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's invite everyone. We want them to come here. Yes, indeed. And let's hope people actually show up this time. Oh, here we go. Hello. What was your name again? Your name was Brienne. Hello, Brienne. Lovely to see you. Okay, people seem to be showing up. That's cool. Um, Beatrice, no, Beatrice, Bridget, you can really just go to bed. Um, has everyone changed into their party outfits? I didn't actually invite our household to the party because, you know, um, they already live here and I wanted as many people as possible. Hello, it's a toddler. Come on in. Come on in, everybody. Um, but I would like everyone to go swim with all of you guys. Let's everyone go have a swim. That might be fun. Okay, people are slowly showing up. Hello, everybody. Hello, Victoria. Loving your outfit. You guys seem pretty angry. Hello, Alice. Long time no see. Um, cool. You guys are gonna head off to the pool. She's good. I should have probably told everyone to come in their swimming outfits since I want them to be swimming, but they'll probably swim eventually if they want to. Um, Beth, are you gonna join swimming? No? How about you jump into pool, backflip? <laughs> sure. Everyone's in the pool! I freaking love it! Hang on, let me pause. This is kind of cool. The hell kind of a look is that, Bob? You look really odd. I don't like it. Everyone's just swimming around. <laughs> good. Are you holding your breath? You know you don't need to do that, right? That's not how swimming works. But okay. 
Um, you're gonna dive? Okay, I'm ready. I'll watch. Make me proud. I don't think you're gonna make me proud. You can try at least. And... Yeah. No. I expected as much. Well, good. At least all of you guys are having a good time. How is the party going? Oh, everyone is dancing in here. Lovely. How are we doing? Are the toddlers playing in the, the playroom? No. The toddlers are... Ah! Playing outside, I think. That's cute. Or at least one of them. Are you gonna go play in here? You're gonna play in there? You are gonna play in here. Lovely. And a jump. And you've appeared again. Good. What are you gonna do now? Disappear and, and appear again. Lovely. Okay. Well, that's boring to look at. Um, where are the other toddlers? What are you up to? Where are you gonna go, my friend? You are gonna go outstairs too. Okay. Outstairs? Outside. <laughs> outstairs. Um, you're just making drinks. Good for you. What are you doing, George? You're just gonna go sit in that chair? Slightly creepy, but okay. Um, Alice is digging the music. Good for you. Is anyone upstairs? Would be a little bit weird. Oh, there are people upstairs. People that have just gone into Bridget's room. Christopher, that is a serious outfit, but um, if you wouldn't mind, I'd like Bridget to be able to just sleep. Um, so yeah, please go back downstairs. That would be great. So, let's see. Can we, Wilbert, let's uh, bake something, maybe? Pre-mixed brownies? No, that's not really what I want. Let's cook something. We can um, cook grilled cheese. I'm sure that will be fine. Uh, and then I would like some of you guys to meet some of our other kids. So, um, friendly introduction, friendly introduction. This is like kids meeting other kids kind of a party. Ah, you guys are hugging. That's so cute. Um, Bob, can you come in here and meet some of your family? Dance a bit with Brienne, maybe? Marie, you can uh, thank Andy for coming. Because why not? Here they all come. You guys are hugging. Lovely. Oh, the toddlers are coming in to the kitchen. That can't be good. This this toddler is going into the bar now. That That's even worse. I'm sure it's fine. What are you doing, my friend? You're just going to take out the trash like in a responsible person. Lovely. Okay, this is insane. Look at this. All of this is our family. <laughs> Hang on. Look at that. That is quite the party that is everyone's just walking around having a great old time jane is getting down into the partying wow love it absolutely love it there's so many people <laughs> i can't quite believe it and all of them have some kind of history with bridget it's crazy just look at that look at that sofa Jesus. Okay, Marie has done something with her charisma skill. Good. How are we doing for partying? Have Sims listen to stereo at the same time. Okay. Let's have you come here and listen. You can come here and listen. And you can come here and listen. And you can come here and listen. Um, then we need someone to tell a joke. You're eating, but let's have you... Um, let's have you tell Alice a joke. Let's do a funny introduction, first of all. Are you just eating on your own? That's kind of sad. Um, oh, you guys are grabbing food. That's awesome. Uh, okay, we've had people listen to stereo things at the same time. That is cool. Marie, can you come here and make some drinks, please? Make um, something cool. That. And then Bob, stop whatever you're doing. And then you can, I don't know. Can you just make a drink at the same time? Probably not. Um, how are we doing on telling that joke, Bob? Um, let's do a funny introduction to Alice, please, maybe? A lot of people going upstairs right now. Uh, you guys are just, okay, in Bridget's room. That's fine. 
whatever. Um, oh, a lot of people going downstairs as well. Oh, you guys! This is so cute! Wilbert is joining! Oh, this is like three generations of kids all hanging out together. I absolutely love that. Okay, can you pretty please tell a joke to someone? Can you... Funny... Tell a joke about monkeys, please. Have Sims be, f be flirty at the same time. That is very inappropriate for this party, so I'm not going to do that. Um, we could have them be playful at the same time, I guess. Can you please have that drink? That would be great. And then I was about to try and control Jane then, and then I realized that I can't because Jane is not a part of my household anymore. Okay, you guys are having too much fun, so I'm not going to disturb you guys. I would like you, however, to make a drink as well. Make that. Okay, so we need Sims to be playful at the same time. So, Bob, come here, please, and watch the comedy channel. Okay, you're feeling playful. Let's have you watch the current channel. And let's have you watch current channel as well. So hopefully that will be enough uh, people to be playful at the same time. Yeah, oh, the house party is complete. Shite, I was not paying attention to the time there. Um, but okay, the house party is complete. Everyone is probably going to start leaving. I just want to... I want to see this. Um, bye everybody. It was so nice of you to be able to come. I had a good time watching you all hang out in this house. There are so many people and most of these are our kids, apart from you, Christopher. Um, and you guys, Brienne and something else. Clarissa? Yeah, I think it was Clarissa. And there's George. Bye bye. It was nice seeing you. Are those the last guests? Everyone's just kind of disappearing. I think that might have been the last guest. Lovely. Well, I'd say that was quite a successful Sunday. Nice little, um, nice little party there. Inviting everyone over and finally having a proper house party in our new house, you know, with loads of Sims. People even played cards down here. It was lovely. I had a great time. Um, now we should probably fix everyone's needs. Uh, Bridget, you're starving and people have... Oh, you just disappeared, Marie. Where did you go? Yeah, oh, you're now over there. Okay, how about you use the toilet and you also use the toilet, but use it downstairs. Um, everyone needs the toilet. Okay, you go pee as well. And then the rest of you are just gonna have to wait. No, you can actually pee there. Um, Okay, Bridget, please get up. And then if we have leftovers, yeah, get some leftovers out. Cool. Um, what are you doing? Not a lot, to be honest. So um, keep doing whatever you want to do, really. You're going to go pee, uh, and then you can take a shower as well if you want to. Where are you peeing? You're peeing up here. So then you can take a shower after that in there. You're peeing there, and you can take a shower there after you are grabbing food that is perfect and you are peeing and then you need social apparently well you know what there are so many people around here that i'm sure you'll figure that out wilbert was the one no who was the one that didn't have anything to do was it you wilbert why are you grabbing food oh no you're cleaning up okay um how about you guys play a game of cards then um play cards with marie no i want you to play with beth um, okay, can you do this then? Challenge, yeah, challenge Beth. You guys can have a little bit of a social time together. That'd be lovely. Bridget is just eating downstairs in front of this fridge because that's the thing that we need apparently. Okay, Bridget, when you're done with all that, I would like you to harvest this bush, please. Um, collect microscope sample. Interesting. Um, harvest the dragon fruits and then some of these apparently can be evolved. It's lovely. All of these can be evolved. Can you be evolved? No. Okay, that's fine. Uh, yeah, I think that's the only ones who can be involved. Evolved. Um, that's fine. Have you finished eating yet? Please just finish eating. It really is not that hard. Um, you guys are gonna do the llama challenge thing. There was a great party. Wait, what are you saying? I hear there's a great party going down at the nightclub. Yeah, we just were partying. You're just playing games. Rory, that's lovely. Good way to end a Sunday afternoon, I would say. Okay, Bridget, you have harvested that. Lovely. Now we need to...
plant this stuff. Let's have you start planting that. And I will, oh, you're feeling a bit nauseous, aren't you? No, I don't wanna purchase seeds. I wanna just plunk these things down, please, if possible. There we go. Plunk those things down and the last one and, and the last one, no. One more time and the last one, there we go. You plant all of them and then I would like you to, no, not sell just the dragon fruits. I'd like you to sell everything, please. I'm gonna sell these while you do your thing. How are you guys doing? Who's winning? Is it you, Wilbert? She looks a little bit sad, so I have a feeling it's Wilbert. Uh, that's fine. Wilbert, you're doing that. Rory, you were gaming apparently, but you're gonna stop now. You're eating, you're taking a bath. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. You're uncomfortable because of the environment in here for some reason. Okay, I um, can't see why. Why would this environment make you uncomfortable? I don't know. You can play a game, party frenzy. How's it going, Bridget? It's going pretty well. I'd like you to water everything as well. Okay, we're selling the dragon fruit and getting insanely rich from it. Lovely. You're also taking a bath now. Okay, it's 10 p.m. guys, so it's probably about time everyone started heading to bed. Uh, what's your bed? That's your bed. So you go to sleep. Okay, yeah, you will actually go to sleep now that it's the right time. You go to sleep and you need to eat something and then go to sleep. Stop that. And then you, Marie, also need to go to sleep. That is actually sleeping. Yes, it is. And you can stop doing that and go to sleep as well. Eh, Bridget really doesn't need to sleep because she never does. So I don't really know what you should be doing after all this, my friend. But I guess you'll figure that out. I'm, I'm sure you'll figure it, figure it out. But yes then guys, as everyone here is heading off to bed, I'm gonna end this episode here because I have been recording for almost an hour and a half with all of the building and creative sim stuff that we have been doing in this episode. Um, in the next episode, I'm assuming Bridget is gonna give birth and we will have more babies, screaming babies to take care of and we'll get to test out the new baby rooms, the new baby cells, if you will. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next episode.